Hey y'all, I am going to do a voiceover for you all today on the video that I did while I was about four months locked for the back and two months locked in the front. And what I did in this video was I combined two locks that were too skinny. And now that I combined, I'm seeing that they were too big. So I took out about three or four locks. And now I am reinstalling um, them back to the size that I want. So what I do first is I, I make a twist and uh, for the bottom to set my foundation. And then I start finger interlocking all my locks. And this is how I installed every single lock in my hair initially. And how I maintain it now is with a nappy lock tool that I will show in another video of how I maintain and retighten my interlocks, microlocks. So um, I did a lot of research on the method and how I want to install my locks. And what I'm hoping I did and what I'm hoping this shows in this video is that I did a four point rotation reverse. And what that is pretty much is, um, going the opposite way of a clock so i hope that's called a uh, counterclockwise i believe and as long as you know your directions of north south east and west you pretty much can understand what a interlock pattern is so from my understanding there is a two-point rotation three-point rotation and four-point rotation and you want to use four-point rotations for um, if you want your hair to be more tightly locked rather than kind of loose. And for the back of my hair in particular, it is not so much dense. And it is very, I have very fine hair in the back. So um, I wanted to do a tight rotation to decrease any slippage that I might get. And slippage is um, pretty much your locks coming out or slipping out. So, let's see. I have sectioned out a part of hair that I want to lock. And I am basing all this by touch. I'm getting my Stevie Wonder on, y'all. So, here's the section that I want to portion out for that lock. I'm securing any other loose hairs or locks that could get in my way. And what I do first is I start off with a twist about uh, about two or three times. Uh, maybe even a little more to start my foundation. And then I just split it anywhere in the hair to go down. And that's going to set my interlock. And what I do is kind of do a few locks to make sure that the end of my hair is going to be locked and doesn't slip through throughout the whole strand. And I'm going to try to see where I'm at in my um, process here. But what I would do, because it's not zoomed in right now, I would highly recommend you check out Patience Edith video. And that's pretty much how I base my hair off her of how she um, installed her locks and also Miss Mercy and I'll include um, either these videos or the name or the uh, the people their pages in this video so that you can see what I'm doing here but this is nothing new um, just this is what I found out through my research and everything how I wanted to install my locks so here we go I go from East to west, south, north to south, west to east, and south to north. East to west, north to south, west to east, and south to north. That's the full rotation. And um, I'll say it again. North to south. 
west to east, south to north, east to west. That is a full rotation. And um, if you just do your research, y'all, I promise you, you will find it. I know a lot of videos don't really show you um, close up how to do an interlock, but I promise you it is not hard, but it is tedious depending on how long your hair is and the density and coarseness of your hair. Like I said, it, it, it took me two months to install my hair. And um, yeah, just hang in there if you're doing it by yourself. And if not, you know, uh, appreciate and acknowledge your your consultant or your lock uh, installer because this is a process, y'all. Like, <laughs> it's not like doing little braids or anything. But, um, yeah, this is pretty much the foundation of all my locks and how I started them. And I will post a video of how I maintain my locks using a interlock tool. And if you have any questions, please just comment and let me know. And I will get back to you all. Everybody have a blessed day. And if you're locking your hair, good luck. <laughs> all right. Take care, y'all. Bye.